Today I got something really exciting from my friends at Louder Than Liftoff. It's a tube saturation and EQ. So I'm producing a track for the rapper Jesse Thomas. We'll run it through some drums, some bass, some vocals, some guitar, and uh, see what this thing can do. Let's check it out. All right, here we have Pentode MK2, by Louder Than Liftoff. And here's what the unit looks like. We have a real analog tube with two different settings, rich and fat. In the EQ section, we have treble and bass with trim pots, and you can bypass each band individually as well with these little jumpers. So if you don't already know, you're probably thinking, how in the world is this an EQ, and how do you get audio in and out of this weird little card. Without going too into it, it's a format called color. You have to have a host for the color. So this is a host, this is a color. You simply pop the color right into the host and you're ready to roll. Let's check out bass first real quick. This is a mod that I added. This isn't normally on this unit, but I have the switch set to switch the bias. So that's what that is. There's our noisy bass. And let's put some drum in the track too, just for reference. So there's the bass clean. There's the pento, pretty subtle. Let's pump that up. It's really nice. Nice and gradual. That's one thing about some of the colors that I've experienced is there's not much of a of a transition for some of them. So that's that's awesome. I like that there. Alright, that's really cool. I like how that sounds. Let's uh Solo up the bass and check out how the bias affects the tone. It's pretty subtle. that at around one to two. I wanna push it a little bit to kind of really get the personality of the unit, but I don't wanna to go too crazy with it. Uh, let's check out the vocal. Um, oh, one interesting thing about this vocal and this song is we are currently in quarantine. The artist sent me his vocal through a voicemail. It's kind of a dark, gritty hip hop thing anyway. So that's what we're working with. Um, let's check it out. Seven cents cents, my less rents from the prince. The one who giveth peace to anyone who repent. It's hard to get peace when you like how you bent. And the twist and the curves of your soul is a friend. But the friend is demonic. No matter how you chop it, you don't know where to go. Every old kind like is an option. The way your soul's up. tied to a cauldron. You love the smell of ash. You eating that flame broil, but that broil is your ass. Survey what Let's go with the that. Say. Let's check out drums.
All right, so I really like that at about two to three o'clock on the rich setting. Now let's check out the EQ. Originally for this drum track, I had some low end and high end boosts going on. So we're gonna approximate that on the pentode. The way that you adjust the EQ is by using a small screwdriver. You can adjust the trim pots on the card. Essentially what that gives you is a preset EQ. In this case, we're going full bass boost and about 50% treble boost. Now by using the mix knob on the host, we're able to blend in the dry signal and have some control over how much boost we want to have. Let's check that out. Let's bring the bass and the vocal back so we can listen in context. Seven cents since my less rents from the prince, the one who giveth peace to anyone who repent. It's hard to give peace when you like how you bent, and the twist and the curves of your soul is a friend. But the friend is demonic, no matter how you chop it, you don't know where to go. Every opine is an option, your soul's tied to a cauldron. You love the smell of ash, you eating that flame royal, but that royal is your ass. Survey what the sage say. All they do is try to show you the safe way But you don't like to go the safe way Now do you Rather have the dead devil and the blue do And who am I to judge I'm liking it no there right about 60% mix we all And 3 o'clock dry sleep, and I'm just Awesome pointing out this While we're here, I noticed that I'm doing A smiley face EQ curve kind of thing With the vocal as well because it was a voicemail, it just needed a little more body and a little more crispness. So let's use this same setting and check it out on the vocal. Seven cents since my less rents from the prince, the one who giveth peace to anyone who repent. It's hard to get peace when you like how you bent, and the twist and the curves of your soul is a friend. But the friend is demonic, no matter how you chop it, you don't know where to go. Every opine is an option, your soul's tied to a cauldron. You love the smell of ash, you eating that flame broil, but that broil is your ass. Survey what the sage say, all they do is try to show you the safe way. Cool, all right. Let's check out the guitar. This time I'm gonna bypass the bass boost. So we're gonna have just a little bit of treble boost on the EQ. There's a few layers of guitar, but I'm gonna jump ahead to the acoustic guitar because that's the most prominent one. So just add little bit of brightness, make it jump out a little more, maybe adding a little bit of volume. Cool. And now what we're going to do is we're going to process each track and just stack pentode up on the track. And then we can pick, compare a full mix with and without the pentode. Seven cents since my less rents from the prince, the one who giveth peace to anyone who repent. It's hard to get peace when you like how you bent, and the twist and the curves of your soul is a friend. But the friend is demonic, no matter how you chop it, you don't know where to go. Every opine is an option, your soul's tied to a cauldron. You love the smell of ash, you eating that flame royal, but that royal is your ass. Survey what the sage say. All they do is try to show you the safe way But you don't like to go the safe way Now do you Rather have the dead devil and the voodoo So there you have it That's the Pentode MK2 from Louder Than Liftoff You can hear everything You be the judge Check out the additional audio files on my SoundCloud And I know we're just scratching the surface here But hopefully that gives you an idea of the character of the unit I personally love it I already loved the original and from my memory number two has everything that the original had uh, but with the added EQ section there's just so much flexibility there it's really amazing so yeah let me know what you think uh, leave questions and comments and thanks for watching peace